so I'm going to show you how I make a bulletproof cocoa really fast. These are little containers that I just get at the Dollar Tree. They hold about a fourth of a cup and they have a lid. So over the weekend I took nine of these and I put a half a tablespoon of coconut oil, a half a tablespoon of butter, one tablespoon of half and half, and then three fourths of a tablespoon of dark cocoa. So I keep these in my fridge because by the time you pull out four ingredients, it just makes more of a mess and takes longer and it just kind of becomes irritating day after day. So I have these little fat bombs and I've already microwaved my water for one minute and I use my son's silicone baby spoon because it's like a mini rubber spatula. And there we go. Now all I have to do is toss that in the sink and then in the dishwasher, take one little drop of stevia and by drop, I mean drop or full, not one drop. I like it sweet. This is my Cuisinart blender. I love it because it comes with a bunch of smoothie cups. Put it on. Blend away. And now I've got my bulletproof hot cocoa. So we are just getting ourselves ready and out the door. Oh my gosh, doesn't that look so good? Oh, I love the smell of it. It smells so coconutty. So another thing that I do with my son is I buy just the little um, Glad Tupperware things. I have lots of different things that I put his snacks in, but I'll take his crackers for a savory snack, and then I just make like a little trail mix for him and he loves marshmallows so there's some dark chocolate chips marshmallows some raw cashews and then some craisins and so this is like his little sweet treat and he's got two little um like empty spots in his stroller put one on each side and then usually that will keep him for at least a good 10 minutes worth of walking sometimes longer so throw those in the diaper bag and we're gonna get on our walk